Fnatic lost their perfect season in the LEC, and there were so many crazy matches in the LCS. If you were too busy playing TFT, then you probably missed all the League of Legends action, but just watch Inside Esports on Squad, plus this video, and you'll be all caught up. So let's get into it. Here are your League of Legends Plays of the Week. Sword doing battle. Cannon Barrage comes down. Hextech Ultimatum is going to be the trade here as Cubase looking for it. Oh, Don't got it! it! He picks up the kill and doesn't die to the Requiem! He held on to the oranges for just long enough. This has the ultimate, has the parkour as well if he wants to get away. Trick down half HP already and Caps just dodges around it all. You cannot catch this man. Odo falls in the side and Caps just jumps across the wall. He's still alive underneath the tower. Abadage might look for the chase. Once again, Caps buys the time of two members while G2 oh. keeps playing. No. Let's check it out. Oh, Wait, does he walk into it? What is oh, oh my god! god! No way! That's just gross. And that death on their jungler means CSM likely will take the Baron here, though. Cloud9 is moving over. They want to look to fight here. Seeky healed up off the Grom. Zazel nearly getting one tap by the Varus. Niski's in some trouble. That's gonna be Varus secure by the side of the Sneaky the Cloud9 is able to find the fight. Sneaky's damage is monstrous, but Broken Blade's able to shut him down. The follow-up damage is there from Niski, and Smoothie will gobble up his teammate over the wall as Kubo shot him to go unstoppable. Yep, that's just such a good path. You go from uh, Raptors all the way to Krogs, gets you level three, and you can decide to gain top or just get back with an item lead and go to your bot side. Oh, early ignite on top of Rookie. Rookie alert. Gotta wait for your flash. He's still gonna wow. die. Early solo kill. Jay just gets him. Three. Shuffled back by the Emperor's Divide. Will he actually fall? Biofrost walking in over the wall. Jensen goes down. It's a one for two, though, as CLG have also lost Whoa. their jungler. Devil is very far forward, but he's able to just bait CLG in. They don't have the damage just yet. Devil's going to be taken low, taken down. Team Liquid are winning the fight for now. The Ruin is rampaging through their lines. One man stands on the side of TL. Xmithy will try to get away. He buffers through the stun, but Ruin will follow. He Ruin. needs a little bit more to chase this Jarvan down. The slow will stop him. There's the stun. There's the damage. Baron is gone. Ace CLG. Well influence the positioning. And they're saying, all right, let's start it. One Mountain Drake. All right, SKT. TP coming in. Flip gets there around 6,000. Let's see what Flip can do as, OK, it's going to actually be Khan trying to start this one up. Perfect timing on the stopwatch there. Tall also going to stop watching. Clay goes and he steals it away. And you'd have to imagine the killers are only going to follow as everybody on the side of Hanwha Life. There is no escape. The Baron and five kills will go to SKT. If you like this content, don't be afraid to hit that like button. And if you want more League of Legends action, make sure to tune into Inside Esports every weekday at 8 p.m. EST. And if there isn't enough esports for you, make sure to tune in to all of our socials at Squad State for the latest esports coverage. See you later.